Well, the weather is absolutely perfect here at the home of Tottenham Hotspur in London. I'm Derek Ray. With me for commentary is Lee Dixon. And there are a few more enjoyable days on the football calendar than opening day in the Premier League. It is Tottenham Hotspur facing Burnley. Well, thank you, Derek. Brilliant atmosphere here today. All that hard slog in pre-season. All aimed for this game. First game of the season. All that preparation is for this. It's for this 90 minutes. Focus on it. Get the three points. Move on to the next one. Looking forward to it. Dejan Kulusevski. It's a perfect challenge. Well, nicely cut out. Now, what can they do with the ball? Can he put them in front? And it's come off the keeper. Oh, and he puts away the second chance. Goalkeeper error. Well, here's the replay, and it's a perfect poacher's goal. Sniffing around, waiting for scraps from the keeper. Ian Wright used to get hatfuls of goals like this. Underway again, and Tottenham with the advantage. And news of a goal in the Brentford game. Alan McAnally has the details. It's a goal for Manchester United. 12 minutes played, 1-0. Thanks as ever for the update, Alan. Son. Now Harry Kane. And return to Son. Lucas Moura. Well, he certainly wasn't offside by a mile. Veghorst. Albrighton. Barnes. And he takes on the shot. Well, no mistake from the keeper acting decisively. Lucas. Hoybier. Son. Spurs pushing forward with options available. Can he finish? And both hands on it. Good goalkeeping. Now, what can they produce on the flank? Westwood. Cork. Well, the timing a little bit off. Alas, he's made his move too early. Offside. Son. They couldn't maintain possession. I believe there's been a change to the scoreline in the Brentford match. Alan McAnally can tell us more. It's a second goal for Manchester United. 28 minutes played, 2-0. Cheers again, Alan. No foul, Spurs advantage. Lucas. Not even close to troubling the goalkeeper. Well, no, I can see what he's trying to do. He just got the technique all wrong. He'll get another chance. McNeil. Westwood. Taylor with it. And disappointing for the players of the centre that it didn't reach them. Kulusevski. Well, let's see what they have in store for them on the break. Well, that break looked so promising, but nothing coming from it. It has gone over the touchline for what will be a throw-in. Romero. Harry Kane. Lucas with it. Well, untidy in possession from Spurs. Well, the ball lost here. And now, passing it through. Will it be Harry Kane? And a goal! He's doubled his total for the day in superb scoring form. So, 2-0 now.
after the teams are ready to have a go at each other again as the second half commences Westwood McNeil and intercepts again Alderweireld under pressure here I understand there's been a change to the scoreline in the Brentford match. Alan McAnally can provide us with the details. It's a third goal for Manchester United. 48 minutes played. 3-0. Regular updates from Alan McAnally along the way. An incisive pass. Chance to make a game of it here. Oh, yes! A goal! Exactly what they were looking for. And he's come up with it. Well, two one it is here. A wonderful bit of skill. Well, with tackling like that, the onus is on the referee to take action, potentially. And the referee has determined that that is a bookable offence. I don't think you can think anything else after that challenge. Cork. Or Brighton. Nice looking pass. We're getting the ball forward. The outcome is a goal kick here. Well, here's an interesting story, one that perhaps a few of you saw coming. John Stones has completed his move to Real Madrid. Well, it's a reported fee of around £45 million, Derek. He's definitely worth that sort of money in my book. Good, solid pro. Technically really gifted, too. Moving forward effectively and crossing towards the far post. Well, there it is. Can you believe this? From two down, they now find themselves level. Number 10. Well, as the game has restarted, we're left to reflect on four goals, 2-2. Two -two. And news of a goal in the Brentford game, Alan McAnally has the details. It's another goal for Manchester United. 66 minutes played, 4-0. Thanks, Alan. Modric. Just the challenge that was required. And a friendly reminder that we have more action from the Premier League coming up. It's Tottenham Hotspur facing Manchester United. Yeah, it's very easy to build a case for those two teams to make that game a real cracker. You should be tuning in for that one. Oh, it's astonishing! One of the greatest comebacks you're ever likely to see. And now the question is, can they see this out? Well, it's really top-class play. Huge amount of work on the training ground in order to drill a team to be this capable of carrying out pressing football like this. Top draw. Emerson. Moving into the advanced position. Well, they keep passing away. Lucas Moura. Lucas! Almost unbelievably, he's kept it out. Well, I'm not sure how he's reached that. Just look at the stretch on that. Brilliant save. And a substitution in the offing. And now the delivery. Well, goal kick, just as it was looking promising. Tremendous intuition to win it back. A move of promise on the flank. This could square the game. Chance maybe. And second time around, he scores. But the keeper left to wonder what his defenders were doing. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. I believe there's been a change to the scoreline in the Brentford match. Alan McAnally can tell us more. It's another goal for Manchester United. Seven minutes remain, 5-0. Many thanks, Alan. Cork. 
inside the final five minutes now. Lost possession. And a goal at this stage could be decisive. It would have been a wonderful scoring opportunity, but offside by a whisker. Well, we often criticise the officials, but he got that spot on. Lucas. And Hoybier with it. Well, totalling up all the stoppages, we'll have two additional minutes. Can they forge ahead? Yes is the answer. And that could be oh so important. Well, here's the replay with the clock ticking down. Has he won the game for his team? Cool, calm and collected. He deserves that brilliant finish. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. And with that, the referee says that is the end of the match. And Spurs victorious. Just a couple of questions for you. No further. Them are ready to fight it out. Who knows what to expect in this game, but there's a chance we'll have plenty of excitement. Stay with us for every kick of the ball, live right here on EA TV. And here we are at one of the great venues for football anywhere in the world, Old Trafford in Manchester. I'm Derek Ray, and with me in the commentary position is the former Arsenal and England fullback Lee Dixon. And we've got Premier League action coming right up. It is Manchester United up against Tottenham Hotspur. Yeah, the talking is over, the game plans are set. Now it's up to the players to go out and earn their corn. There's nothing the managers can do once the first whistle goes. I think, Derek, we're in for a cracker. Oh, tremendous block. Something to worry about here. And the keeper acquitted himself well. Yeah, it was a good ball in, wasn't it? But the keeper did everything right. And here's the lineup for Manchester United. David De Gea begins in goal. Rafael Varane plays alongside Harry Maguire in central defence. And the main striker is the unmistakable Cristiano Ronaldo. Oh, he's given it. Penalty. And an opportunity now for them to jump in front. Penalty given and yellow card handed out. converted well here it is again and a good penalty for me is one that just hits the back of the net left right down the middle just find the goal underway once more Tottenham have the lead Bruno Fernandes It's with McTominay. Crisp tackling. Son. Lucas with it. Kane. Can he do it? Excellent block. And he's won the ball. Could cross it in here. Hoybier. Now Son. The ball with Luka Modric. What a poor ball giving possession back to the opposition. Bruno Fernandes. Excellent ball over the top. Pulls it back. Showing good defensive judgment. Well, Tottenham are struggling in terms of possession, but to their credit, they've been absolutely blistering on the counter-attack. They just sit back, hit you on the break, and it's really working for this team. Shaw. He's enjoying space. And players waiting in the centre. 
Fred. Here's Luke Shaw. Bruno Fernandes. And now Shaw. Disappointing for United to give it away like that. Well, that's the kind of player you want from your defender. Giving the ball away. Maguire. They've given it away. Bruno Fernandes. Modric, spot on. Lucas Moura. Poor attempt at a pass, really. An effective challenge. So the second half underway, with Spurs looking to build upon a largely positive first-half performance. Son. Lucas with it. Modric. Well, they couldn't keep it. Scott McTominay. Here's Mata. Bruno Fernandes. Ronaldo. What can he do from here? This could square the game. Crucial intervention just then amid impending danger. <laughs> Over it comes. But the keeper takes command. Scott McTominay. Harry Maguire now. Fred. And the flag has gone up here. Offside the decision. And United will switch things around personnel-wise. Lucas. Fabier. Really good challenge. Well, there has been speculation about this story, but now I can tell you it's official. Naby Keita has... And it's fallen for Ronaldo! And it's in! A goal for Manchester United, who find themselves now level. So, a level contest. 1-1. Cristiano Ronaldo. And space to exploit, maybe. Oh, big chance! And the cross not quite imaginative enough. They take it short. Can he find the angle? Tremendous block. Ronaldo, and he scored not once but twice. They simply cannot stop him, and no wonder he's enjoying himself. What a big moment in the dying embers. Will it prove decisive here? And Fred winkling possession away from the opposition. Jadon Sancho. Shaw. Fred. And they've won possession again. Just a reminder, we have more absorbing action from the Premier League coming your way here on EA TV. It's Manchester United facing Aston Villa. Yeah, get... and he's in. And it's come off the keeper. On a time for composure on the ball. Ten minutes left for play in this match. Well, United just have to try and hang on here. The fans are trying to get them over the line. 
Jadon Sancho. And now Shaw. It's still there for him. Ronaldo at the ready. The clearance wasn't decisive. Shaw. A goal has gone in at Molyneux. Let's hear more about it from Alan McAnally. It's a goal for West Ham United. Three minutes remain. 1-1. Thank you, Alan McAnally. The clock is against Tottenham, but they might yet bite back. And a goal to level it up late on here. Just look at the reaction. Well, here's the replay. What a time to score, Derek. Kept his cool so late in the game. Easy to snatch at that one. Is there time for a winner? Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Two minutes of stoppage time coming up. So the final whistle and the two teams cannot be separated. It is a draw. Just a minute of your time. No further questions.